Bitcoin has collapsed under $9,000 for the umpteenth time in the past few weeks. Minutes ago, the leading cryptocurrency slipped under $9,000 for the second time in the past week. As of the time of this article's writing, BTC trades for $8,960, having bounced $50 or so from the daily lows. Bitcoin slipping under $9,000 comes ahead of the weekly candle close and a few days after the monthly candle close. Considering the timing of this drop, it may suggest that investors expect the S&P 500 and other global markets to open in the red. After all, the price of BTC has traded in tandem with the S&P 500 over recent months as global markets enter a period of uncertainty. The ongoing drop has not spurred a massive liquidation even thus far. According to data shared by crypto derivatives tracker SKU.com, approximately $5.5 million worth of Bitcoin longs on BitMEX were liquidated in the past hour. This may sound like a lot, but it's far below the dozens of millions worth of liquidations normally seen during drops to the downside. The low level of liquidations can be attributed to the fact that Bitcoin barely moved from a macro perspective, falling a mere $100. As Bitcoin's move below $9,000 took place just minutes ago, analysts are still reacting to it. According to Blockroot's founder Josh Rager, a move below $8,900 would spur a move to even lower levels. He stated last week in a separate analysis that Bitcoin losing the $8,900 support is likely to result to a drop to $8,500. Fortunately for bulls, the cryptocurrency has yet to lose that level. But considering that this move is still ongoing, it could happen. Stepping back, others are more optimistic. Mike McGlone, a senior commodity strategist at Bloomberg Intelligence, wrote on July 2, this came shortly after he released an extensive report indicating Bitcoin will head higher due to fundamentals.